right now there's that saying, oh, you know, everybody's doing charter schools or everybody's doing these, you know, project schools. And that might not necessarily be the right thing for your child. What I like about St. Stan's, when I come here, there's a sense of family, you know, values and the rich tradition and even the little small things. And when we go to the grocery store, for example, and he's singing a song from church and he's singing a hymnal. And the people you know, turn to me, I'm like, oh, he's such a good little Catholic boy. You know, it brings a, a touch to my heart that he knows these little songs, little things like that. Um, you know, you can't get that anywhere else. Having a good day? Yeah. Awesome. It's a very family-focused environment where children are nourished, they flourish, they have incredible school spirit, but I think that's because we recognize their beauty. We are here to celebrate each and every one of you. St. Sands is probably the most diverse school I have ever been in, and I've been in a number of schools. They really are able to get an education socially and culturally as well as academically. Okay, so today we're going to be looking at accepting differences. Okay. There's always something to learn about from every student. Mm -hmm. Like one's from the Philippines, one's from Africa, one's from Poland, Mexico. It's always something different. We were really taken by the fact that Spanish is a standard course at the school along with their focus on leadership and the seven habits, that was a big selling point for us. To be a leader is to show gratitude and be respectful and always try your best. Do first things first, be proactive, begin with the end in mind. So we have no idea what sort of jobs our kids will be competing for when it's time for them to enter the job market. And so having these skills like accountability, responsibility, taking initiative, team building are really important. I think a solution that makes everyone happy. Caring about yourself and others. And compromising. Georgie, come up here and share the story with us. I think it also ties to reading and writing workshops because we teach them about taking ownership of whatever they write and becoming young authors and illustrators of their stories. Today in reading workshop we had a reading celebration. We had a little note card who we'll picked through our reading lab what's our favorite book. And we'll write dialogue, a symbol, or a sentence in the story. I love reading and writing workshop at St. Stan's. It allows for students to work at their own individual levels. So students are always working on things that are challenging for them and things that are interesting to them. It's part of the everyday math curriculum that games are interwoven throughout the lessons in a unit and it gives the kids an extra chance to practice the skills that they're learning. My favorite thing to do in math is long division. So it's, it's fun. The lucky pick. Oh yeah. My favorite subject is science. It's all hands-on activities. It's always interesting. Always something to do. Pick up the two cups. Feel the difference between them even though they have approximately the same amount of soil in them. They're learning how to use scientific equipment and they're learning how to collect data and you know what makes good data and not so good data and then how to analyze that data. In coming to St. Stan's, the added plus to us was that it provided a full day kindergarten where a lot of the public schools half day. a half day kindergarten and it also all day preschool with that and the extensive aftercare program that they have here at St. Stan's is actually fabulous. It's nice that everything is here. There's continuity the time. For, the, for the kids yeah. to be in the same place and get the education, so I like that. We're going to run as many laps as we can and we're going to count them with paper clips. Ricardo, you were saying Anthony, right? We try to keep our children, our young people, grounded in prayer. That's their communion with God. We want to nurture that intimacy they have with with the Lord. Amen. You know, my daughter's in a classroom with um, two amazing teachers. Her classmates are great. The parents are great. And I don't think you can put like a value, a dollar value on that. I think it's, that in itself is really priceless that I can actually go to work and feel very comfortable leaving my daughter in school. Uh, la primera vez que entré en la puerta era 
sentí el, el calor, el calor de la escuela de, de bienvenida que me dieron. Every day you learn new stuff and every day you can bring that home to you. Our doors are always open to prospective families, so we welcome you to come and visit this amazing community we call St. Stanislaus Kostka School.